congratulations. You touched on it there that obviously you know you're wrapping this tournament, but not very good. Does that play on your mind coming into it, especially in a huge game against Luke? No, not at all this year. Didn't practice, haven't picked a dart up since Pro Tours last week. Got to do Pro Tours, as we keep mentioning, you know what I mean? Get the ranking points. But um, no, um, no, not not picked a dart up like I have pretty much all year, you know, just this new regime. And and someone said to me earlier, he said, oh, how do you think you're going to get up? Like, how are you going to do up there? And I just said, I just said, I just want to find it. If I can find it and then I'm in the game, you know what I mean? I can, I can produce produce good legs um, it still feels a little bit alien not gonna lie because it always does but um, no I suppose when the pressure was on it was it was nice to hit a few trebles hit a few doubles you know double 18 treated me well tonight and all up until I started pulling but um, yeah it's just, just nice to get a win all in general you know I, I probably ain't got words for it because um, not my most favorite tournament in the world you touched on the format being alien. The fact it was Luke's debut as well. For someone that has struggled with it, can you sympathise with him coming here on debut and, and not finding it? I think the first set, yeah, maybe. But then I actually thought he was he was pretty decent after there. You know, um, it's one of them things. I walked in and I thought to myself, my first initial first year, what I done, and I thought oh, I smashed this. I can hit doubles. I can score, and I can hit double at the end. It's just easy, you know. And then you go up there and you play experienced campaigner like Steve Beaton had me trousers pulled down and, and me bottom smacked and um, that was two years in a row and all oh, I think I'm still sore from there you know eight years ago but um, nah for me look it's awkward it's awkward it's either I find it or I don't and it's one of them things this year I've just I'm not worried I'm not defending off of anything off it you know now only disadvantage I suppose two years time I've got to defend the first round again Rob, many congratulations. Cheers, pal. Rob, do you feel you're being overlooked at all in this tournament? <laughs> you watched me play for the last eight years? No, it's, um, it's one of them. It, it, look, if I, if I can find an happy medium in my head with it, because it is me, I think it's a great tournament, by the way. I think, um, look, it's fantastic, it's different. It's not my kind of different. But look, a lot of players, they excel at it also. I, I seem to find it just takes all the things what I want to do away from me sometimes. It takes it takes the power scoring away early, and you know. But the finishing I'm pretty good at, and and you think that I pick the pieces up. But um, nah, for me, look, the tournament's brilliant. It's it's just my head. What I want to play ball sometimes. Talk me through the sort of the new regime for you, and what were the reasons behind switching to that? I did, I suppose. Look, I. Did. I've done this eight years and I was always regiment with what I was doing through um, I'd get back, I'd travel on a Monday so I wouldn't practice but then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday whatever days I was home I'd practice and then I wouldn't practice on a Monday you know um, I actually had had a bit of a repetitive strain for a while too and, and I just thought to myself do you know I need to stop this and not only that I think you look at the game and it actually ruled me instead of me saying to myself oh do you know what believe in the ability just believe in yourself, go out, do what you can do and, and, and literally just be yourself, you know. Instead of, instead of telling myself that I've got to miss more hours with the family because I'm down the road practising at Scotty's or wherever, you know. Um, I, think, I think it's just opened a lot more avenues. Probably gives me four hours a day extra <coughs> when I'm at home so I can see my kids and, and do all them things, you know. And I suppose I feel more satisfied in life getting them kind of things because... Obviously, we live for a busy schedule, you know. Cheers, Rob. Thank you. Rob, you're here as a seed in the draw. What was your reaction when the draw came out and you saw that it was Luke Lillard? I, do, I really not. I, do, I don't mean it rude to him because I think look, he's a phenomenal. He's just, well, I'm going to use Michael's word actually. He is phenomenal, you know. Um, I wasn't too bothered. If anything, yeah, I would have rather it been a straight format because I thought myself at least, yeah, I can offer a little bit more, you know. Um, no, but it, it, it all about me, really. I didn't know what to expect or what version of me was going to turn up and probably basing it in the last seven years it's not been a good version you know so um, I enjoyed that a little bit more to the end and, and got got a bit involved in my checkouts you know got off well so um, yeah hopefully hopefully that sort of stays for the rest of the week and then we never know How would you reflect on how the season's gone so far and do you feel ready to really kick on now over the next couple of months? I feel fresh. I've had, had a bit of time off. Um, 
back end, well, sort of like the middle, middle, just past the middle of August, you know, I have three and a half weeks, and usually I have three and a half weeks off and never practice for it. I thought I'd come back and I'd just pick up where I was, and I, I probably noticed with my game that actually I was only there sort of 40, 50% of the time with good legs, and then I wanted to have a few ropey ones, but probably in the last, I don't know, been been building up for three or four weeks now and I actually feel like the game's there now I can do some damage I can work with it and um, it's back to sort of where it was maybe a few months ago you know I was in really good form there um, it's one of them things it's, it's just life and it you can always bend down pick nothing up or you'll bend down and you'll pick something up so um, now nah, for me I'm, I'm happy with it at the minute the way I'm letting them go and everything is, is <coughs> nice Rob, we've spoken about your record here at the World Grand Prix, but how much is that down to the short format? And is it a relief that now it starts to extend and get a bit longer? <laughs> I'd, I'd like to sit here and probably say that. I've, obviously, I've done it twice before. Um, yeah, I'd, I've had some good sets, I've had some bad sets, you know. Um, it's, it's probably just on me. And, and this year, I've not, I've not tried to practice it. I've not tried to, I've not even really thought about it. To be quite, f well, to be quite frank with it, isn't that? It's, it's not one of them. It, it, I don't think it plays to my strength sometimes. But then saying that, if I get it right, I can I can play the game. You know, it's um, it's just sort of like a catch twenty two with it, really. But look, I'm positive with it. I'll come out and I'll play in a couple of days' time, and I'll give it everything what I've got. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna plow everything what I can into it because because look, ranking event, important tournament great tournament if you can get on with it but um <coughs> but yeah it's all about it's all about doing well and 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 sort of keep building on that ranking you know um going to be tight by the end of the year with all different stuff so um looking forward you know what i mean just to try and uh, trying to get it right and if i can do that and i can feel happy in myself and be happy with my form i think i'll do damage in other other tournaments coming up you mentioned that schedule there last year you had a great back end to the year, so many deep runs and big tournaments. Do you do anything differently when you know that you've got pretty much no gaps in the calendar to the World Championship? No, not really. I can't. You know, I had all my gaps at the start of the year and I thought to myself, I'll take this, I'll take that. I've left myself tight, obviously, on a pro tour, which I think I'm just about just in at the minute. Um, I wouldn't change anything. I've, I've enjoyed my time, but at the same time, I need to play everything now. It's the business end of the year and stuff, and I think it really benefit me, you know. I think we get, well, as long as I qualify for minor, no worries, you know. If I get to all the TVs, that's what it's all about, and that's where you want to shine. Big stage, go out there and, um, and try and do some damage on the field, really. Cheers, Rob. Thank you. Cheers, pal.